It would probably help if I were to turn on my mic. <laughs> now you guys can hear me. <laughs> okay, so back at it again. I'm gonna just like lower the volume on this just a tiddly bit, just in case the game volume is louder than I am. If it is, please let me know, guys, just so I can make everything balanced. That'd be great. Alright, so, back at it again. Woo! So, I'm just gonna adjust one little thing here. Boop. Just one little thing here. Boop. Just the camera angle. Boop. And make this go a little bit higher. Come on. No, you can. Uh, make it go a little bit lower. Come on. Okay. Awesome sauce. So, back at it again with the Wizard of Z101. Ooh, I'm level 8 already. Sweet! So, back at it again. Last time we left off, I was still... Ooh, one second, guys. Wizard! I'm excited to tell you about an amazing new feature in the Pet Pavilion. The hatchmaking ki kiosk. Go check it out. Ooh. Oh, that's right. I got uh, the ability to have pets. Oh, I get to make Gamma's voice. Ooh, wizard. Something very exciting ha has happened. Ooh, the pets page of your spellbook now links to your pet home. Ooh. I love making Gamma's voice. He's such a fun voice to make. The pet tome. Oh, every pet lists every pet highlighting the pets you own. Your tome begins with all pets in your inventory. You'll need to update the rest. <laughs> Check your bank in attic and visit all your houses to automatically add the pets in those places to your tome. Catalog them all! Woo! <laughs> oh man. Okay. So, let's see. Last time I checked, we were practically done with Triton Avenue except one side quest. So I think I'll go finish that side quest really, really quick. Oh, that's Cyclops Lane. Don't need to go there. Oh, right, I might want to finish up her quest since I collected the Mistwood. Might as well pick up a cattail. That's always helpful. Alright. This Mistwood should do nicely. Well, I sh certainly hope it should. <laughs> Miss Tangletree gets to work with hammer, plane, and saw. In a few moments, you have a nice little work table. Now, with a basic crafting table, you'll have a place to work. Yay, I can craft now. Razor's Edge, first crafting quest. Now, with your work table, you can begin to learn the fine trade of crafting, making your own items. First, you should place the basic crafting table in your dorm room or castle. Well, it's gonna be dorm room since I don't have yet access to having a castle. Gotta level up for that, sadly. But I'm getting there. Yeah, your first assignment is to make two daggers of absolution. You should have no difficulty. Which said daggers I am going to sell straight after I make them because they are absolutely useless. Ooh! Hola, como estas? My name is Dora. Oh! Hola! Bienvenidos a mi stream. I really hope I did not butcher that. Wait a second. <laughs> Hi, Blue Dragon. 
That was funny. That was funny. <laughs> uh, I I know quite a bit of Spanish since um, I'm half Argentinian, but that that was impressive. <laughs> For a second, I almost didn't recognize you there. <laughs> uh, I should have read your whole entire username. Sorry, my friend. <laughs> but still, that's pretty cool that you. Uh, popped in with some Spanish. That's cool. Anywho, <laughs> as I was doing with this, first you should place the basic crafting tip. Wait a second, I already said this. All right, so she said place the crafting table in the dorm room, not the castle, since sadly I do not have access to a castle yet. I'm still only level eight and then make the Daggers of Absolution, which are not going to serve me any use whatsoever, because they're weak-ass daggers, so I'll end up selling them. Eh. But I'll gain a Novice Crafter badge for it, and the more experience I have with crafting, the better things I can craft, the more awesome gear I can make. Okay. <coughs> You'll need to buy a recipe from me, and then gather the required ingredients. When you get all of your ingredients, use your basic crafting table to make the athames. Athames? Athames? Uh, athames? Uh, daggers. They're daggers. When you have made two daggers of absolution, see? She calls them daggers. Why are they athames? Athames? Ath ath whatevers Bring them back to me, and I'll award you a novice crafter badge. So remember to bring them here when you are finished. Good luck. I can't wait to see them. Yeah, ne neither can I. Okay, <laughs> so I'll quickly buy the Daggers of Absolution recipe. Okay, so what do we need? So, since she wants to. Okay, mistwood, cattail. So, eight pieces of black coal, and then four sapphire. Okay. So, I think I can buy that from this dude over here. So, buy more. I think I said eight pieces of black coal really hope so. I really hope I didn't get that confused. Athem. Uh, you think they're pronounced uh, them? Huh? Yeah, that would make sense. Who knows? <laughs> okay. Wait, did I just buy 16 pieces of black? I really hope not. So buy more. Oh, nope, not that much. Four, buy. I think I just bought 16 pieces of black coal. Good job, Shania. Well, if I ever need extra pieces of black coal, hey. <laughs> Anywho, I'll just do that quick. Okay, she speaketh, so I voice her. Have you brought the two daggers of absolution that I asked you to make? No. I just bought the recipe and the ingredients. I wasn't talking to you, lady. If you don't have them both, I can't help you, dearie. Yeah. I just bought the stuff. I think I accidentally clicked X. Ugh. Well, I'll take care of her quest later. I'm gonna finish off the side quest for Triton Avenue really fast. Let's see, so I'll have to talk to her. Ah, yes, I have to 
get the haunted minions keystone to check on that one guy's buddy. Let's see, so I have yet to find the shopping district smith. I need to find the old town smith. Cyclops Lane, Trenton Avenue. Okay, anything else? Ah, uh, that's gonna wait a long time since I don't have access to Marleybone yet. Um, so yeah, let's do this first. And before I go, I think I'm just gonna take a look around to see where that little tiny smith is for Prospector Zeke. Just so I don't have to worry about it later. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Ooh, a deep mushroom. Reagents are always good. More mess wood! Ah, I'm stuck. Dang, nabbit. Alrighty. Okay, mistwood is always helpful. You never know when you're... Ah, dang it. <laughs> ah, you never know when you could use it. Okay, so... The little fella's not over there. Smith is near the bazaar. Oh! Thank you! You just saved me a lot of time. I appreciate that. Like, you saved me quite a bit of time. <laughs> okay. Alright, so he's near the bazaar. Oh! There he is! Thank you! Locked in your memory. <laughs> eh, that, that's good. That's always helpful. <laughs> I sadly do not. <laughs> that's why, no matter how many times I've done this quest, I'm still like, okay, so where was that one smith again? <laughs> yeah. Ah! Uh, Thanks, Mercy King, for the host again. You're awesome. <laughs> uh, I love it when people host me. It's so sweet. <sighs> uh, okay, so, Haunted Minion, taste bl blood bat, my friend. You should pretty much easily go down with this. And give up the keystone. Also, I hope that both the ha <laughs> you fizzled. I hope both that the um Wizard One O One music and my voice are both hearable. If not, please do let me know. <laughs> I'm still trying to find a balance. Cause sometimes in my streams I mess up one audio over the other, like Either my voice is louder than the background, or... Holy crap, I collected the keystone that fast? Yes! But yeah. Uh, sometimes one is louder than the other, so... Eh. Eh. If it's like that, please do let me know. Because <laughs> I want to make the stream as awesome as possible for all of y'all. Because just the fact that you guys are watching means so much and it's so much fun to talk to you trust me I love talking to all of you guys <laughs> especially uh, uh, regulars like you blue dragon and M mercy king now all we need is chaos and we got the whole gang Okay, <laughs> yeah. come out, come out wherever you are, little smith. Cause I need to find you, yes I do. I need to find that little smith. It's gotta be somewhere. Cause if I can find that, and then also do the thingamabob, that'd be great.
Smith is near Waterfall. Oh, thank you, my friend. And see, I got the song request working. Now I just hope that uh, it actually plays it. I'm going to pause this really quick and pull that thing of bobber up. See if I can get it going. Let's see. Always lost not found, but I didn't realize in my way of leading me astray. Now it's a meteorite. Come on. Oh. Let's see what happens. Still trying to figure it out. But turn it and Smith and it, they aren't playing right now. Now I hear the music, but turn it up. Oh, okay. Let's see. I'm gonna turn it up to like just this volume. I don't want it to be too loud and overpower. Okay. So that song is currently playing. And let's see. I hope I can uh, uh, get the songs. Let's see, what would happen if I were to do this? <gasps> yes! It's working! It's working! Oh my gosh, <laughs> why am I not surprised, Blue Dragon, that you requested? <laughs> oh my gosh, my friend. Okay. Uh, too low? Okay. I hope that that volume is good, else I'll go back in and fix it. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. I had to put limits on it. <laughs> Believe me, my friend, you are not the only one who would troll. friend are not the only one who would troll me. <laughs> I have quite a few people that will willingly do the same thing. Okay, so waterfall you said. Thank you for the tip. Much appreciated, my friend. It was on that lower level. Oh, it was on the lower. <laughs> Oops. Like I said, no matter how many times I do this quest, I have troubles finding that little tiny. Yeah. Oh, I see him. He's on the lower, lower level. Okay. All right. By the way, Blue Dragon, the song is gonna s get stuck in my head. Ah, going the wrong way again. Crap. Okay. Huh. You hope it does. Oh, I thought we were friends. <laughs> Read that? The music is getting lowered. I am in control of the stream, my friend.
You know, if you keep doing that, Blue Dragon, I'm gonna turn off the music. I am not afraid to do that. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you for getting the keystone. Vlad fits the keystone into the teleporter. It begins to glow and hums to life. The teleporter is fixed. I'm glad some things are going right around here. Please use the teleporter here to check on our mill foreman. It's a whole more sunblade. He's been missing since the mill shut down. Okay. You're giving me more experience, so I shall do that. Whee! Hello. Hey, Mercy King. Thanks for the host, by the way. You rock, dude. You're testing your luck, Blue Dragon? Oh, I can tell. Before I do so Homer's voice, I'm going to check on the sound list real quick. I'm going to move this over here. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm just gonna keep that in the background just so I can keep an eye on the songs and stuff. Because <laughs> I don't trust you, Blue Dragon. Because, <laughs> dude, if. Eh, my friend, if you <laughs> keep requesting those two same songs, I am cutting the music. Okay. <clears throat> I'm fine, you whippersnapper, but we have to get the storm mill working again. This mill here is one of the main sources of magical energy for wizard uh, for all of Wizard City. The undead sabotaged it. We have to get it running again or we'll be in serious trouble. Professor Bailstrom helped design the so storm mill so he might know how to fix it. You will go to. You will need to go to Professor Bellstrom and ask him for his advice. Go quickly. Oh goody! I get to do his voice. <laughs> oh, we are friends. We are. We are friends, Blue Dragon. But my patience only goes so far with those two songs, my friend. In fact, I'm gonna check those songs once more. Mm. Okay. hope that uh, everything is not in too overpowering. Hmm? Hmm. I swear I heard, I heard something. Oh my gosh. I heard something. Eh. Okay. But yeah. Everyone please tell me if all of the contrasting music is overpowering and driving y'all nuts. Because I have these, so I'm not worried. This is just for you guys' listening pleasure. Me, on the other hand, I'm good. I have headphones. But, like I said, I just want to make this stream the best possible for you guys. So, yeah. Please do let me know if a certain dragon's song requests, yes I'm looking at you my friend, are contrasting with Wizard101's music and my voice. Because yes, I do support song requests, I am all for it. 
but when things are like contrasty or they just don't work, and why is this taking forever to load? Yeah. But yeah, when things are contrasty and they're if they grate on someone's uh, nerves, then yeah. Ah, okay. I actually support that song because Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is actually really, really good. Okay, what's going on with this? Blue Dragon, when you gonna learn, my friend? You can only request one song at a time. Or two songs per user. I'm not entirely sure how it works, but yeah. Okay, what's going on here? Okay, guys, we might be experiencing a slight technical difficulty. Wizard 101 really quick and then see if I can fix it. Okay, I'm gonna read what I'm seeing right here for you guys. Okay, so, Wizard 101 will be offline from approximately 3 to 5 a.m. Central U.S. time for server maintenance. You will not be able to log into the game until this maintenance is complete and this downtime will be extended without prior notice. It's 11.37. 3 to 5 a.m. U.S. Central time. Okay, that shouldn't affect right now. That shouldn't affect right now. Okay, let's just try logging in. <sighs> Guys, do not adjust your vertical and or horizontal. This, uh, this is not a test. We now have control over your computers. Oh, when the main the, they'll actually notify us? Oh, okay. That's good. That's good. And that is so weird why Wizard froze up like that. That makes, like, no sense. One moment, guys. Come back in. Sweet. 
does sometimes get a little buggy and make me see. Right, eh, at least got back in. Alright, so go home. Gonna check something really quick. Okay, Blue Dragon, my friend, I'm gonna, um, let this last, um, these last two songs play, and then I will close up the songs, because I'm feeling like it's kind of contrasting with Wizard 101's music. But, if you tune into my cosplay streams, the song request will be able to go through the whole entire stream. I just feel like it's kind of contrasting with the game's music, and yeah. But don't don't worry, it will be available um, during uh, the cosplay streams, and that's tomorrow. A cosplay stream will be tomorrow, I promise. And then. That's when all of the awesome music can be played. At least I got the command working. That's always good. This guy in here. Do that. Hang this up. Hang the myth banner up. Come on. Go. Then put the bottle burner there. Let's see. Come on. I want to hang up the wand. Come on. Load the wand. Good. Bedside desk. Et voila. We have a cool looking room. Da -da -da -da. I'll just quickly make the daggers of absolution. So, create. Awesome sauce. One dagger of absolution is created. Just gotta wait like 25 seconds for the next one to be able to be created. So I'll just pop in after. Alrighty. Okay. Let's take a look at that music really quick. Okay. Alright. Because you had the last bar doesn't mean I won't get stronger. Wait a second, I can I can this one. Okay, Blue Dragon, my friend, I'm showing it off right now. Sorry to say, but tomorrow I'll let the songs play. But for now, it's contrasting with Wizard 101. You'll be able to request songs to your heart's content tomorrow on the cosplay stream, but for now, it's Wizard 101's background music. And that background music ain't so bad. Yeah, never figured out how to craft things almost. 
Oh, it's actually quite simple, Mercy King. Uh, you just go to um, that one lady I was talking to uh, in Old Town by um, by the bazaar. She's like one level down uh, on this little cliff thingy, and you get the novice quest. And then you just buy recipes according to your level, and you can craft some pretty sweet gear. You just have to craft. Uh, craft. <laughs> Shania can't speak today. Uh, you just have to collect the specific materials. Like you can craft robes, you can craft wands, all kinds of equipment, castle items. It's really cool. See here. Yeah, but also, I am the streamer, and I do, like, hear what's going on, and if I have to be completely blunt, Blue Dragon, the music was kind of bugging me, uh, giving a contrast to Wizard 101. I'm sorry, dude, but it was. But yeah, but I promise I will play it tomorrow in the cosplay stream when there's literally silence while I craft stuff. I promise. But for now, wizard sounds and me talking, because I feel that's a better balance. Yeah. Okay, on to the frog's voice. <coughs> oh boy. Dire news indeed. If the mill is not restored, Triton Avenue will lose its magical power, and the rest of Wizard City will follow. We must act right away. Tell so Homer he can summon a Kraken using Lumina Crystals. Then he can siphon its power back into the storm mill and get it working again. Hey, I didn't hurt my voice this time. Sweet. Okay, I'm gonna quickly go back to the dorm. Oh wait, I don't need to do that. And also, Blue Dragon, not to sound like possibly mean or anything, but I just want to say, like, my stream, kind of, my rules, I'm picky about how I have things. I mean, I do want to make this stream as fun and as awesome to watch and listen to for all of you guys, but, yeah. Oh, yeah, I did join the, your uh, server in Discord, Mercy King. I, I liked it a lot. It was fun watching uh, uh, the little bot Pokemon battles. I might join in one of these days. Okay. It's not ready. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I don't have the enough. <sighs> okay, I guess I'm gonna have to look for more Mistwood. And then buy more black coal. And then, hey, Mercy King, you got online. Awesome, dude. And then get more sapphire. Eh. Oh well. Gotta get more materials. <laughs> That's cool, you finally made it online. That's awesome. But yeah, I really liked your Pokemon server, it was cool. But yeah, going back to what I was saying, Blue Dragon, not to sound mean or anything, it's just, I, I want to make it so not only, um, the people watching, like all, all of you guys watching it, um, uh, enjoy it, but, like, um, it's fun for me as well, 
because even though I don't hear too much with the headphones on, I uh, still kind of know what's going on. I know I'm blabbering, but yeah. Just want to make it a balance. Because while playing games, I feel like uh, having extra music uh, in it kind of contrasts with the game. But while with doing the cosplay stream, if I have music in the background, it's it actually fits. So, yeah. That's just how I want to have the streams. So, I hope you understand, my friend. Okay. Penny. Wonderful. Let me see what you found out. Mm, not sure I like that voice for Penny. Penny takes the worksheets from you and reads them. Her eyes grow wide and she giggles. Seasoning? Serving size? Cooking time? Oh no, I gave you the wrong worksheets. These are for a report I was writing about the types of food we eat in Marleybone. Don't worry though, I think I can make these answers work. Thank you. Well, you're welcome, my dear. Okay, I can't thank you enough, Sisteva, for all your help. I thought I would have a hard time finding friends here, but you've been wonderful. You seem to know about what's going on. Did you hear about Malastare in the death classroom? Yep, I did. It disappeared. Went poof. Bamboozled. Poof. A year ago, he left here in a storm, and the whole death classroom disappeared. Broke right away from Ravenwood, and you were the last one to see him. In the Golem Tower. Is it true what they say? That he's plotting to destroy all of Wizard City? Why would he want to do that? I hope he stays away from Marleybone. I want to go home someday. Ooh, if I can keep that little accent. That reminds me. Could you do me a favor? I need to mail a letter to my family in Marleybone. Do you know of anyone who travels to the spiral? If you do, could you ask him to deliver my letter home? Penny hands you a letter addressed to Desmond and Deidre Dreadful at 57 Chelsea Court, Marleybone. Yeah, that means I get to talk to Professor Jessica. Hey! Hey, where's the gang? How you doing, dude? Yes, I'm checking your level. I check all my friends. Ah, level two. I'm not the only one who... <laughs> Yay. <laughs> but that would've been cool if you were much higher. But still, that that's cool we're close in level. That makes me happy. That means we can do some requests. But go! I'm glad you could come in. Thanks for the follow, Matt. I appreciate it. I hope you have a fun time uh, watching the streams and uh, having fun being a fellow quotable. Welcome. Try me level 101. Dang. Okay, that's impressive, dude. Level 101. Nice. Eventually I'll get up to that level. <laughs> right now I'm only like a level 8. I did once, though, have a level 88 um, myth wizard. But that was a couple years back when I was extremely addicted to Wizard 101. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> hey there, youngster. Anything old Zeke can help you with? Mm. I had such a perfect accent for him earlier. You ask him about delivering the letter to Marleybone. Oh, sure, that's no problem. I go there all the time. Let me take it off your hands. Uh, I'll improve. You give him the letter. Okay. Uh, oh, back to Penny. 
Want to... Yeah, sure. I would love to. I love making new friends uh, on any of the games I uh, play. That'd be cool. Oh, thank you so much, Sestiva. You're the nicest person I've met since coming here. Oh, why thank you. <laughs> <sighs> I forget how uh, tough the voices can be on the throat. <laughs> oh, nothing? Nothing else? Let's see. Okay, talk to Ambrose. Talk to her. Um, talk to Sir Homer. Find more smiths, and I can't do that until I have Marley Bone. Where'd you go, Mercy King? I know I was doing other quests. Mercy King. Ah, uh, dang it. Well. You know where I am, my friend. You can teleport to me anytime. Okay, back to Old Town. I really should put a marker there. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for the follow, Matt. Welcome to the sp Spaztastic Quotable Family. Because that's what I think of all of you guys. A cool little quotable family. Dang. That's cool. But yeah, I know the feeling of starting all over. I did that quite a bit. I had like a completely other account. Okay, apparently I only had to make one dagger of absolution. Well, that's fine by me. <laughs> Those are quite nice indeed. I'm pleased to award you a novice crafter badge. Display it with pride. Will do. When you earn a new crafting badge, you can buy more advanced recipes allowing you to create new and more powerful items. Cool. What recipes do you have, lady? Okay, so, Athames, or Athames. Athens, or at the what? However you say it. I had work on my quest. Oh, understandable. N no worries, my friend. Yeah, if you ever want to quest with me, Mercy King, you know where I am. <laughs> Just teleport in. friends. Dang, Matt. That's... That's impressive. Okay. So. Stiletto of Prowess. <sighs> and we have this one. One power pip chance. I mean... It's good, but this is better. So I'll buy that, and I need three more miss wood. I need, let's see, two more black coal, sapphire, two sapphire, and two, what is that, ruby? Okay. I'll just buy the ingredients that I can. Oh, wait. You have something else for me. Oh yeah, I said I could get you started, and you've certainly grasped the fundamentals of crafting. That's all I can teach you. Okay. To become a master artisan, you must learn the crafting styles of all of the worlds of the spiral. Okay. <laughs> if you wish to continue your studies, you should 
go speak with William. That's an interesting name. In Krakatopia, he will be happy to continue your training. Don't have access to Krakatopia just yet, but eh. What Oh, don't worry. Uh, no offense taken. Ah, dang it. Darn camera. Oh, come on. Work with me, camera. Okay. <laughs> Maybe next time I stream uh, um, Wizard 101. So, that would be... Okay, so today's Tuesday. I don't stream on Thursdays. I stream on Fridays. So... I'll be streaming Wizard 101 Friday. So, we could do that Friday if you want. That, that'd be cool. Servers are going down for maintenance in two hours. Ugh, okay. And if I'm still streaming by then, then uh, I'll just switch over to a different game. <laughs> Simple as that. Where could he be? Cool. Well, that would be a lot of fun. <laughs> Can't wait, Matt. And Mercy King, if you want to do that as well, that would be awesome, dude. I would love to um, battle against you guys. That'd be so much fun. Whoop! <laughs> I almost got pulled into a battle there. That would have not been good. I still can't get over how amazing these graphics look in Triton Avenue. They really did a good job. Whew. Excuse me. Because, I mean, years ago when I used to play Wizard 101, like, a lot, they, um, had the Triton Avenue looking, eh, look nice, aww. <laughs> My wizard or me? Well, either way, that's a nice compliment. Thank you, Matt. It's a nice compliment either way. I appreciate that. That's really sweet of you. <laughs> Wonder how these guys are faring. <laughs> well, they're up against haunted minions. So, <laughs> I'm sure they're gonna do just fine. And that same thing. Wait, what same thing, uh, Mercy King? So, 2v1? <laughs> I don't know if that's possible. I mean, that would be fun. But I don't know if uh, Wizard 101 allows that. Although, a uh, 2v1 would be hella fun. <laughs> I'm all for that, if you are up for it, Matt. Because you say you have a 101 level wizard, and it would be a almost level 10 wizard, and um, a level 5, or I bet you're going to level up really fast, Mercy King. Uh, so, uh, probably two level 10 wizards against a uh, 101 level wizard. I think that's fair. Because we will probably get creeped. But we can try our best! <laughs> okay, he asked if I had some Lumina crystals, but Gamma's Beak! Why didn't I think of that? He's a genius! I really have fun with those deep voices. Here. I'll ac activate this teleporter. Take all the Lumina crystals I have down to the arena. The Kraken will be drawn to them. 
I hope you're up for this. You have to defeat the Kraken if the if Triton is gonna survive. I know you can do it. Oh, with the you got the same notification of the server shutting down. Yeah. Yeah, that would be cool if we can do a 2v1. That's if, um, Wizard actually lets us. I don't know if, um, that's possible. Would be so cool if it was. Oh so, boy, here's the Kraken. Let's see <coughs> how would he sound. The great swoop. The sea, his greatest wrath is about to come crashing down upon you. I could have done better. Let's see. The sea's greatest wrath is about to come crashing down upon you. Yeah, I'm still not pleased with the voice. Oh well. Let's do this. Okie dokie, 510 life. Eh, I can take him. Okay, so, first, one spell. Get more of this awesome cream soda. Let's see, you haven't laid a single scratch on me yet, so... I'll attack with my troll! Troll power! Yeah, 2v1 would be a lot of fun. Oh! Hi! Oh, it's glitching on your side, Mercy King. Yeah, <laughs> I know the feeling. Let's say hi to this one person real quick. There we go. Oh, there's a storm. Oh, they're a high level storm, at least a medium level storm. Because they have the converter. But yeah, it's being buggy, that's for sure. Haha, <laughs> crack and fizzled, the crack and fizzled. Oh, excuse me. But yeah, it's never fun when it's buggy. You, my friend, I hope you don't mind that I'm about to do what I'm about to do. Strong beetle. Eh. That didn't do much. Okay. Troll power. <laughs> and a uh, goodbye. Bye bye, Kraken. The storm magic of the defeated Kraken flows into the air and up to the mill. Cool. Ooh. Aw, oh, heck yeah, I'm equipping that. Oh good lord, that color. I mean, it's somewhat okay, but yet somewhat not. 2v2. Oh! I mean, I'm, I'm still up for it. <laughs> I don't mind a 2v2. <laughs> You'll find that I'm quite competitive, even if the odds are st stacked against me. I would totally be up for it. You defeat the Kraken and fix the mill. Now, Lumina Crystals will be produced again. The magic will flow once more. Ho 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 ho. Oh man, his voice. It's good to know wizards like you, my friend. I hope you will visit us again, Sestiva. Yeah. Sure. I mean, you're gonna eventually have a... Yes, I leveled up. Da 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 da. Ha. Da 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 da. Ha. <laughs> okay. So, let's see. What level am I currently? Level 9. Okay. So, anything else? Merle... Uh, hmm. So I don't have 
Oh, excuse me, guys. Mm. So I don't have access to the under the sea, under the sea realm yet. Because I forget what I need to do to unlock that. But eventually, I'll unlock it. I think I need to hit like some kind of level. So my friend doing I'd be down. How about you, Mercy King? I mean, the odds are kinda stacked against us, but eh I'm competitive for a reason. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, missed wood. I need. I need that. My precious! <laughs> and I still don't have access to this. Okay. Well, whatever. Okay. I'm gonna just quickly go to the. Well, I'll just hit end and just go to Merle Ambush straight away. It would be fun. Yeah, I agree. It would be fun. I'm up for a battle, even if the odds are stacked against us. I think that would be a cool challenge. Okay. Okay, that's a cool mount. <laughs> Alright. Hello, Merle Ambrose. Let's see if I can actually get your voice correctly this time. Bye, Bartaby. You defeated the Harvest Lord. Not many students can make that claim. Good work, Sestiva. Eh. It's getting there. The Harvest Lord mentioned that he was helping Malister. We need to find out what Malister's plans are if Wizard City is ever to return to the nice place it once was. It it's hard to run the school with all the monsters running amok. His voice will get better. Many thanks f to you for straightening out to everything on Triton Avenue, Sestiva. I fear the worst is not over yet. Yeah, his voice definitely needs work. Okay, I want you to introduce yourself to the Diego. The hmm? strange. I thought I heard my name being called. Uh, I must be hearing things. You have a Discord? Yeah, I do. Uh, you can get to it on my um, info page on my uh, Twitch bio or by this. I'll show you. Uh-huh. See if it's working. Ta da! If you need the code, there's the code to join the Discord. There you are, my friend. Alright, okay. I want you to introduce yourself to Diego, the duo master. He manages the arena. Uh, <laughs> that means I get to do Diego's voice again. <laughs> That'll be interesting. The arena is just inside the entrance to Unicom Way. On the right. Okay. Ooh, the pet quest. Have you had the chance to visit the new pet plane in the commons? It is a wonderful place where pets can be trained, hatched, and even raced against the fans. I need to work on my accents. It's quite easy to find. Just head towards the library. I was wondering if... Hmm. I was wondering if you might do me the favor of delivering this parcel to Milo Barca. The ring must... He sounds Spanish, not British. <sighs> hmm. Um, he's codes. Oh. 
Sorry about that. Uh, well then how would you like to join the Discord? Because that's kind of the only way I can think of. I mean, my Discord username is just Quotable Creations if you want to friend me. And then I can invite you to the Discord channel that way if you want. But else that's like the only ways I can think of. <laughs> <clears throat> I was wondering if you might do me the favor of delivering this parcel to me, little Barker, the ringmaster of the pet derby. Have care not to crush or drop it. That wouldn't be pleasant. Ah, gee, I wonder why it wouldn't be pleasant. Could it possibly be a pet? Hmm. Can you add my Discord because that would be easier for me. Yeah, sure. I'll do that. Uh, what's your Discord, Matt? Just tell me and I'll add it. Headmaster Ambrose and Ans you. <laughs> Ans. Oh my gosh. Hands you a box with some air holes punched in the top. It makes a slight grunty noise when you shake it. Well then don't shake it. Simple as that. Please convey this item to Ringmaster Barker. Post haste. He shall reward you handsomely for your efforts. I'll do those quests a little bit later. Is that the name of your Discord, Matt? Wild? And the number... Okay. I'll do that right quick. Discord. Work with me, buddy. Okay, let's see if it works. Then boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, let's try this. Boop, 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 boop. Dang it. Boop, 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 boop. Sorry for the delay, guys. Just trying to join a Discord server. Boop, boop, boop. Hope you're enjoying the sound effects in the meantime. And boop. Boop. Yep, it's not letting me, Matt. Not letting me join it at all. It's saying it's either expired or um, invalid. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, oh, I just missed that. Eh, I'm sure it wasn't anything important. Alrighty. See, why can't I use that voice when I need it? <laughs> it's like all my cool voices fail me right when I need it. Okay. I'll do that then, my friend. Boop.
There we go. I think I got it. Haha. <laughs> I hope I got it. <laughs> Yay! I got it. <laughs> cool. Okay. Ah, yes. Going to Unicorn Way. To talk to Diego. Whose voice I'm actually pretty decent at now. <laughs> Alright. <coughs> Hello! Greetings! My name is Diego Santico Cru Ramirez the Third, Champion Duelist. Hey, don't apologize. It's okay, dude. No worries. The Duel Master bounced with a great flourish of his cape. No worries, Matt. It happens. The arena is a wondrous place. Students come here to t hone their skills with magic, practice against others, and gain endless glory and fame. To try your hand against your classmates, enter the arena and step into the duel circle. If you train well, perhaps you can develop to rival even the great Malister, yes? With the duelist he was, He's the only person I would not want to duel in a real fight. Luckily, we only spot for practice. Oh, speaking of Malister, did you know that he and Cyrus are twin brothers? I would not be surprised if Cyrus was helping Malister with all this mess in Wizard City. You just tell Ambrose to keep an eye on Cyrus. Alright. Wizard! Hello! At last you have come. Any logo? And I have may perish under the weight of this disrespect. Really? <coughs> okay. Okay. You see, my friend, I have been burgled. Oh. Well, I'm sorry. A priceless family heirloom was stolen by my most archest of nemesises, my evil twin brother, Roboto. He's wanted the item since we were cults. I tried to confront the fiend, but he secured himself behind a wooden skeleton lock. A pa oh, and this will, this is a powerful word I thought only a legend until now. I am certain there's a way to unlock the bony barrier, but I am too busy training new students, the competitive arts, to do research myself. However, I did hear there's a new assistant in the library who is focusing skeleton locks and keys. Could I impose you upon you to consult him? Yeah, sure, I'm doing psychos anyways. <laughs> Alright. Oop, wrong way. Okay, let's see what we're doing. So... Go here. It's gonna be a little bit till I get to Cyclops Way, <laughs> but I will get to it. But yeah, no worries, Matt. Don't feel bad. It happens. Cause hey, we got uh, the friend request to work, so that's all that matters. Don't worry. And I just went the wrong way. Whoopsie daisies. Hey, Mercy King, you're back online. Cool, and Giant Bunny. You guys saw that too, right? That was a big-ass bunny. Okay, getting lost again. Here we go. Come on, Shania, focus. You talk, I talk, you talk, I talk. Focus. <laughs> if any of you have seen the ventriloquist Jeff Dunham, you'll know what I mean. Alright. Okay, not talking to you, not talking to you. Gotta go up here to talk to. Mm. Oh man, it's a monkey.
conquistador. God, I hate conquistadors. Can I help you? Dear God, the door wants to seek information about the one skeleton lock. Why? That happens to be my field of expertise. Yeah, that's perfect for him. Skeleton locks are enchanted doors that can only be opened by a corresponding key. Thus, Diego's wooden lock requires a wooden skeleton key. But those keys are typically quite difficult to come by, coveted as they are by what I call bad folk, and they shatter after one use. Hmm. Fortunately for you, I have one skeleton key I can part with if you take this key ring with you on your adventures. Okay, yeah, sure. I'm <laughs> free. <laughs> awesome. This keyring detects nearby skeleton keys and sends data back to me for continuing my research. Plus, it will mark your map with key locations. Eh. Well, I bid you and Diego good luck with whatever waits behind the wooden skeleton lock. I'm counting on you to explore the entire spiral. Okay. <laughs> you found your first skeleton key. These enchanted keys unlock powerful wooden doors. Warded doors. This one unlocks a wooden door, but yeah. Tomato, tomato. Which you'll discover great rewards. Different types of skeleton keys will open different kinds of locks, so pay attention. And each skeleton key can only be used once. Remember that great reward is often won only through great risk, so be wary of the monsters you discover behind the locked doors. Of course. Okay, um, can I get you some treasure cards tomorrow? Oh, you don't have to do that, Matt. But if you want to, sure. Just tell me when you're on and I'll, uh, get onto Wizard and... Yeah. And Mercy King, what spell could you learn? Um, uh, what do you mean, dude? Let's see. Like, you are level... Oh, nice hood. <laughs> You're level four, so... Uh, let's see. I'm not too familiar with the life spells. I would probably go to your professor to see what kind of spell you could learn. That's probably the best way. <sighs> That's probably my best advice. I wish I was more familiar with the life spells, but sadly I'm not. But you're leveling up pretty fast. That's impressive. Nice going. Okie dokie. Hello! You're back. What did the librarian's assistant say? We need a wind skeleton key? Of course. Curse this bad luck. What's that? The librarian's assistant gave you a wooden skeleton key? I knew you'd come through for me. That's why I hate to beg another favor f of you. Ah oh boy. Will you do, Roberto, and recover my precious heirloom? Let me explain. As much as I would love to battle my brother, honor forbids it. You see, Roberto and I may, may an oath to our mother on her deathbed that we would never take up arms against family. So, I cannot fight him. However, we also made an oath to our father on his deathbed that we never back down from a challenge. So I must fight him, using my difficulty. Yeah, <laughs> what a difficulty that is, my friend. Roboto stole the heirloom knowing I'd be unable to personally retaliate. But there's no dishonor if I send a proxy. Especially not if that proxy is my most prized pupil, who learned everything they know about dueling for me. Will you do it? Uh, 
Yes, thank you, my friend. You can find Roberto and he's in there. I'll mark your map. Alright, so we're gonna fight Roberto. I just wanna be able to be a video camera. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh, Matt. I mean, that is sweet, but you gotta care about your own happiness, too. I... I totally understand how that is. I mean, I, I can be a lot like that as well. But you gotta also care about your own happiness, because elsewise, if, if you don't look after yourself, you can't help anybody else. And also you make the people uh, close to you worry. So look after yourself. Care about your happiness, my friend, because it, it's important. And Mercy King doesn't have anything for me yet. Not until level five. Whoa, you're close. And whoa, dragonfly. That's cool. <laughs> but you're close. You're getting there. I believe in you. Hope everyone's enjoying the stream so far, by the way. Try to make it as awesome as possible for both me, the streamer, and you guys, the viewers. I appreciate every view you give me. Trust me, it means the world to me that you tune into my stream. Oh my gosh. I know how you feel. I struggle with that sometimes too as well Matt but you just gotta get through it somehow find things that make you happy whether it be video gaming or maybe hanging out with friends just trying to do something that perks you up I know I'm probably not giving the best advice but just See, I mean, in my case, I usually just like listen to music or um, immerse myself in um, like the stuff I love, like the things pertaining to my dreams, hence quotable creations, content creating, because it's my dream to be a professional content creator. So I immerse myself in stuff like that. So you just got to find something that makes you really happy and do that. Okay, so you're talking to uh, your friends and family and gaming and uh, talking to people in the stream makes you happy? Then do that! Because it's all about finding uh, uh, what will perk you up. Because, yeah, it's important to try to find that light at the end of the tunnel. Believe me, I, I was in your spot. Trust me. But yeah, I I know you, I know you can find something that'll make you happy. It's possible. Okie dokie. Huh? Was that a reagent? Nope, that's a stone. Just a regular old stone. Okay. Oh, hello. You're doing this too? Cool. Or not? Okay. <gasps> Ooh. Awesome. Yay. Okay. Going down. I may now enter. Come on. Let me enter. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Let me in. Kidding. No, come on. Okay. No, don't. Okay. Wahaha! You loped right into my trap, my foolish brother. 
Wait, you are not my brother. The Zeth coward Diego sent the child to fight his battles? So be it. Why was his voice easier? Okay, I'm gonna apologize really quick. There. Okay, well, okay. T talking to streamer also makes me happy and singing. Then do that! It, it's important to do things that make you happy. That's what makes life, well, worth it, in my opinion. Just finding things that make you happy and going for it. Following your dreams, all of that stuff. Sheesh, I sound like a self-help book. Eh, well, it's because I've been in your place, Matt. Trust me. I know- well, I should probably select a spell. That would help. Okay, but yeah, I've- I've been in your place. Trust me. Okay, I- What is this spell? I have not seen this spell before. This spell is cool. He just... And I just... He just killed him with... How the hell did... Holy Shinola. Enough! Here, give the baby back his toy. I only stole it to irk him, but it's no fun if I don't get to see the look on his stupid face. Besides, it isn't clearly lucky at all. It couldn't even help me defeat a lowly whop like you, excuse you. Just take the piece of junk and get out! Get out of here! Well, that's not a very nice unicorn. But I did see that I got a new ride. Okay, that's a deck. Hmm, fine, I'll exit. Sure, if you want to, Matt. I don't mind. Okay. Yes, I know it'll start the timer, but I want this ride. Yay, I'm going faster! Hee <laughs> hee Woo! I mean, it's only a seven day mount, but I'll take it. But yeah, huh, that'd be cool. Okay, there we go. Is that a panda? Oh my god, that's a panda. How did they get that? Okay. Holy crap, there are 105. Man, I want to get to that level. Okay, Grand Panda. Crowns only. Oh. Crown Shop Pet. Of course it's cool. Man, I need more crowns. I decided to learn Life and Fire. Oh, that that's a good combo. Wait, you know you can buy permanent mounts with gold. What? Checking now. You can do what now? You can buy permanent mounts with gold. Okay, no, I don't want that. Do you mean like from uh, Prospector Zeke or like um, only some in the crown shop? Like probably some of the older ones. 
Let's see if I go like down to the older ones. Like say the wings. Okay, I can't. That. Oh. Okay, so some of the really older ones. Okay. Well, that's cool. That's cool. Cool. Hey. Hey, Mercy King. Oh, it's okay, Matt. Don't worry. At least you can buy some. Hey. <laughs> hey, Mercy King. Okay, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go talk to Diego now. Yep, I appreciate the info, Matt. I love learning new things, especially about uh, games. You've returned with my great grandsire's lucky unicorn shoe. I knew that scoundrel Roberto would no be no match for my favorite pupil. It's a good thing that that librarian student that no one had ever heard of before literally had the key to solving this problem, no? <laughs> Indeed. Ha! You see, my friend, this unicorn shoe brings luck to everyone. Well, for everyone but Roboto. Ha 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 ha. Thank you again. Yeah, no problem. It gives me experience. Hey, Mercy King. <laughs> uh. Okay, so, what are my quests now? Okay, talk to Merle. So. <laughs> so, and. <laughs> oh, Mercy King. You're, you're obviously having a blast going in circles around me. <laughs> but I have to quest too. It'd be cool if we were on the same quest. Okay, let's see if I can actually get this accent right. Diego thinks that. <clears throat> Bloody hell. No. Come on, British accent. Hmm. By a bot, Diego thinks that Cyrus is helping Monster cause all this trouble in Wizard City? Eh? Diego shouldn't. Be spraying foolish rumors. Cyrus is a good professor. I trust him completely. I could do better, but for now, that's okay. By Bartaby, I'm sure you heard that Master Drake used to teach at th this school. He was once one of our best professors. Very powerful and compassionate. He loved discovering secrets of power. The only thing he loved more than the power was his wife Sylvia. Ah, that explains it. May she rest in peace. If only she was still with us, things may be different, but even death cannot be undone. Speaking of issues concerning Milestone, one of his favorite students, a boy named Duncan Grimwater, ah, I know who he is, has been Tackling a ghost problem over on Triton Avenue. Can you inquire whether he has he? Blah 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 blah. Can you inquire as to whether he has heard anything from his old professor? We need to know if Malstel has been contacting his former students. Okay, the voice is getting better. Sweet. Yeah, when I have more uh, gold, I'll buy some mounts with gold. Okay. Do the quest for Star above the quest lines. I should follow you quick. But. Do have membership. Yep, I have membership. 
And I also do like, um, uh, side quests to level up too. I do a mix. Hey, Mercy King! <laughs> hey, dude. Hey. Hey, we're kind of matching with our robes. You're blue and black, and I'm blue and black. Well, yeah. That's cool. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to Duncan now on Triton Avenue. Catch you later, my friend. Oh, boing, boing, boing. But yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, no problem. I, I totally understand. I appreciate the help. That's why also I put um, the tag uh, in my stream, Backseat Gaming uh, Totally Allowed. Because I appreciate uh, tips and advice in Wizard 101. In any games, really. I appreciate it a lot. So don't be afraid to give me tips or any of that. Trust me, I don't mind. But yeah. <sighs> so, back to Triton Avenue I go. I hope everyone is enjoying this stream so far. I try to make it enjoyable for both all of y'all watching and, of course, me, the streamer, because <laughs> if it wasn't enjoyable for both of us, you could probably tell I wouldn't be having fun and then you guys wouldn't be having fun and, yeah, snowball effect. How did I do his voice last time? So, the headmaster is still worried about Malastare? If you ask me, I think Ambrose needs to quit blaming Malastare every time something goes wrong in Wizard City. Eh, that voice is okay. Malastare Drake was such an inspiring professor. Most consider him to be the greatest necromancer of our time. He understood life's limitations and strove to face them unafraid. Ambrose has suggested for me to stop practicing the death arts. He even suggested I give life a try. Ha! Huh. I keep studying on my own. Maybe one day I'll be uh, as powerful as Malastare. If you want to find out more about Malastare, maybe you should talk to an old friend of his wife. You have heard what happened to Malastare's wife, right? No? Oh. If you are interested, go to Gloria Crendel in Old Town and ask her about Sylvia Drake. Those two women were close. She could tell you more. Hello again! <laughs> Wee! I some houses in the ground shop. Yep, that, that I know. I found out that a while ago and I was so happy to find that out. Because you can buy some really cool ones. But sadly, until that experience bar goes all the way full, I can't buy a castle as much as I wish. But I'm getting close. I'm getting close. Whew. Okay, Gloria Corrindo. You want to ask me about Malastare's wife, Sylvia? Oh my, yes, I know her very well. She taught the life magic class before Mulinda Wu. Ah, oh. alright, forgot about that. I sure miss her. What happened to her was such a shame. Poor dear. Madame Crendel becomes forlorn as she relieves this, relives, not relieves, Relives, Gamanchanaya, speaketh correctly. The sad memories. Say, there is something you can do for me, child. Would you go find the scrapbook Sylvia and I made together? It would mean a lot to have it back. 
I'm not sure how, but Sergeant Skull Splitter has it. Could you go to his tower on Triton Avenue and get it back? I just came from Triton Avenue. Eh, okay. Get it back for me. Ooh. Holy guacamole, I keep yawning. Not to self, keep coffee with you on next stream. <sighs> I know, Matt, you're trying to help, and I do appreciate it. Don't worry, dude. Like I said, I appreciate it. I'm just saying that I figured that out a while back. But still, I appreciate the help. Akuna Matata. No worries. Akuna Matata. You're really sweet to try to help. Okay, let's see how this is gonna go. Hey, you finally joined a battle with me! Cool! That makes me happy. So, you've come for the scrapbook that belonged to Master's wife, eh? Pity she caught that cold and died. Well, I won't allow you to have it. I will deny him any kindness after what he denied me in life. As for you, wizard, prepare to join the ranks of the undead and serve me. <laughs> yeah, that would be awesome. I uh, really appreciate any help on quests. And believe me, as I get higher up in the worlds, I definitely know I'm gonna need it. Especially when I get to Celestia. Pretty world, but pain in the ass world. <laughs> I mean, Celestia's fun and all, but holy cannoli. So yeah, I'll definitely take you up on the questing help. Plus, I just like questing with others. Hey, Bloodbath, don't puke on me or my friend. Hey, don't puke on either of us, Bloodbath. Yeah. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that. Summon a troll and attack! Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> 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 Excuse me. Oh, I definitely need to keep like an energy drink or coffee by me. Last time I've had so much more energy. Oh, thanks, Mercy King. I appreciate the heal. Ah, stupid pixie. Dark fairy. Bad dark fairy. Okay. Wait a second. That means I fizzled last round. Dang it! I hate fizzling. Fizzling is evil. Oh really, a scarab. How frightening. <laughs> it's not frightening at all. Oh, you cannot use the my own spell against us. That is not cool. Well, 85 damage. Eh, that's not too bad. Thank goodness you're a life wizard, Mercy King. Okay, just use a blood bat. Get them. Give you discuss one. Yeah, if I have the time to get on tomorrow, I'll definitely get on tomorrow. But that depends on if, like, I'm busy or not. Else, it'll have to be when I stream again on Friday. But either way, yeah, totally. That'll be cool. Thank you so much, Matt. That's so sweet of you. 
Oh, sweet. One enemy down, one to go. Woo! We're a good team, Mercy King. Will do, my friend. I'll tell you on the Discord if I'm able to come on tomorrow. I love making new friends on Wizard and through streaming. Online friends in general. Really cool. Okay. Oh my gosh, you have five health left. Oh, you're going down, Mr. Skeleton. And it is dead. So wait. Okay, nope. <laughs> yep, thanks for the help. Mercy King, you're awesome. Boing, boing. <laughs> Okay, now back to Old Town I go. Whew. Wow, I'm getting kind of tired. I may actually sign off when I get to Cyclops Lane. There's still so many side quests that need to be done. Well, I'm glad you're happy, Matt. I'm glad I can help make you happy. I love making people happy. Even if I don't know them very well. I love making people happy. You were able to get the scrapbook from Sergeant, Sergeant Skull Splitter? Oh, good. I was so afraid it was lost forever. It contains all my memories of Sylvia. Oh, excuse me. Madame Crendel begins to thumb through the old scrapbook. Now, let's see. Ah, uh, yes. Sylvia had such a wonderful laugh. It was so sad when she got sick. She caught a nasty cold and wouldn't get better. They tried everything to heal her, but nothing worked. Imagine the greatest life professor being struck down like that. It is sad, that's for sure. She was dying, and that was that. Poor Malastair couldn't stand it. It broke his heart having to let her go. I can imagine. That's like the only sympathy I will give that character. He was never the same after. He withdrew from his colleagues, even from his own brother, Cyrus. Well, thanks for bringing the scrapbook back to me, child. I am forever grateful. No problem. Okay. Hmm, 26 health. 1% resistance to everything. Well, the resistance doesn't matter just yet. So, 26 health is. Oh god, that color is awful. Okay, changing that, and then I'll go to Cyclops Lane. Okay, there's a cool magic carpet. You, sir, have a cool magic carpet. Oh, someone made the pogo stick. Doing, doing. Only those of you who have watched F. Dunham will have gotten that joke. I'm seeing if I can milk a wizard. <laughs> I know the feeling. <laughs> but that's okay if you can't. I like working with you on uh, this account too. So, no worries, Mercy. Either way, it's cool work, uh, questing with ya. Okay, let's take a look at the quest lines first. Okay. Hmm. Oh, 
that means I'm gonna talk to that guard. Okay, that's the commons. Wrong way. To the Cyclops lane, I go. Alright, well, have a good sleep, Matt. Thanks for joining the stream and thanks for the follow. I'm glad I got to talk to you and meet you. <laughs> have a good night, my friend. Talk to you next time. Oh, you're an hour behind me. <laughs> well, have a good night. Talk to you later, my friend. Okay, giant problem. Yes, I know it's gonna shut down in an hour. Why do you think I'm gonna sign off soon? Okay, giant problem. There's a kid in Cyclops Lane named Nolan Stormgate. Otherwise known as Cocky McCocky Pants. You should talk to him. He sounds like he's in trouble. Oh, really? <laughs> he's dealing with the giants there and has been asking us to send students. Better go see what he wants. Okay. Oh, you're gonna make me accept it immediately. Fine. Oh, I didn't read the thing of his quest. Oh, well. Only an hour left on the server. I know. I'm gonna sign off soon, cause I'm getting tired myself. Oh, hello, Le Master Weeb Power. Welcome to the stream. Holy crap, Cyclops line. Okay. Apparently, they redid Cyclops line as well. It looks cool. But yeah, welcome to the stream, my friend. I may not be on for that much longer though, but still, welcome. Oh my god, they made the trolls look cooler. Ooh, I wonder how they made the Cyclops look. Oh, sick. King's Isle really outdone themselves. Cool. Ooh, Miss Wood. Hello. Okay. Deep Mushroom. I know the smith is somewhere. Oh, I can't wait till I get access to this chariot. Because then I get access to Aquila. And that is some of the funnest side quest lines ever. Okay. The smith is somewhere. It's somewhere around here. I know it. Ah! Stuck. Stuck I am. Okay, wooden chest, 13 gold. Haha, uh -huh, I knew the smith was around here. Hello. Okay, got that one. Eh, I'm not gonna do the silver chest right now. Oh, what do you want, Professor? Stick up his arse. You don't know how to open a magic chest? How tedious. Yes, I do know how to open a ma magic chest, I just don't want to right now. Most chests are locked magically. To break the spell, you'll have to solve a puzzle. Ah, there's his voice. If you can solve the puzzle, the chest will open, and you'll be given a reward. Is that everything? Good. Please don't bother me again. Professor, stick up his ass, everybody. Okay, Nolan. What do you got for me? What are you doing here? Only talented wizards like me should be out in these dangerous streets. Think you have what it takes? This place needs real heroes. We'll see if you can make the grade. Why, I oughta. You're a fellow mythy. Come on. I'm just as strong as you, mister. Let's see how useful you are. Professor Drake put me in charge of a very important mission. Magical artifacts from the old death school have resurfaced. I've decided you're going to recover the one inside the spooky dark cave. 
Every other stone I've asked has been too afraid to go. I'm hoping for... I'm hoping for better from you. Battle everything in the dark cave until you find the ruined skull. Why I oughta. <sighs> well, Wizard 101 is gonna close in like an hour. And I'm getting pretty tired. So I'm gonna leave it f here for now and sign off for now. It was fun streaming t Wizard 101 tonight uh, and hanging out with all of y'all. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I did. Tune in tomorrow for my cosplay stream. I'll send out um, the usual notice on my Discord, on my um, social media, and all of that. Well, have a good night, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Have a good night. Talk to y'all later. Quoty, Shania, Nai Nai. That was a hat tip to you, Mercy King. You gave me that, that uh, nickname. <laughs> and Naya, all of those names, you guys can call me. Out. Have a good night, everybody. Later.